Hi everyone, Rob Wiseguy82 here. Um, another one of my uh, videos. I, you know, I said I was going to be showing my December, uh, December, December number one variants. But I was going through the box, and uh, I want to show this off. Um, obviously, this is Cowboy Ninja Viking, no longer around. I believe it was 2009 that it came out. Maybe not quite that long, but. Uh, you know, for any new collectors out there, um, I'm very new, and obviously I wouldn't have heard if, about this or seen this if uh, I did uh, if I didn't, uh, you know, do research things like that. Um, you know, I saw a bunch of other things that Riley Rossmo did, and this is again, you know, what drew me to this book originally because I just put his name in uh, a search engine and uh, all the things that he had worked on. So. Uh, obviously, this is a pretty expensive book. This is the number one uh, first print. <clears throat> uh, there are no variants, I don't think, that I've uh, been able to find. It can be pretty pricey. Some people want 50 bucks for it, 30 40 50 60 something like that. Um, you got to be patient, guys. I was looking at, you know, for months for these copies. And this isn't perfect. I don't know if you could tell, but... It's got a little schmutz right there, but uh, unbelievable shape, definitely unread. Uh, but I got one through ten. There's, it's a ten issue. I don't know if it's supposed to go on or what happened to it, but um, there's been recent talk of Chris Pratt playing the main character Duncan. Um, anybody who doesn't know about it. Uh, I'm about halfway through the first volume. There's two volumes. Uh, like I said, 1 through 10. Uh, Lieberman, I don't know his first name. I should have looked it up before I started the video. But then Riley Rossmo does the art. And definitely one of my favorite artists. These, you know, what? why I didn't show, why I'm showing this instead of the other one right now. Um, because I know there's no other variants, is because these are some of the best covers that I've ever seen, that I've ever come across in this short amount of time that I've been collecting. These are my favorite. Uh, by far, these are amazing covers. Um, <clears throat> so this is number one. Definitely the most mild. This is number two. And uh, what this is about for the new collectors, or for anybody who's never heard of this, is... You know, like I said, I'm only halfway through the first volume, but um, our main character, Duncan, has multiple personality disorder. He has three separate personalities in him. Um, one of them is a cowboy, one of them is a ninja, one of them is a viking. The government has pumped him full of stuff, made him, uh, made each one, the government is uh, what made him what he is. Um, he's basically an assassin, um, I guess I'm not too good at reviews or anything like that, but it's an amazing story, look it up, check out some other reviews, there's some really good ones out there, uh, that's number two, let's see if we can get a little closer, because I mean, it really is really cool, that's one of the other characters, um, Navy Diver, Gladiator is another is his other personality, and then a pilot. And then there's our character Duncan. You can see he has a samurai sword, a pistol, and he's got his Viking helmet on. Uh, the other really cool thing about this is that each page is oh, you know what? I got the uh, awesome. I've got each chapter. So there's the first chapter done in blue. And then next chapter, it all they're all different. Green. Let's see, there's where I'm at. It's amazing. <clears throat> so this is number two. This is an awesome one. Look at it. And the colors are just—they're not the normal colors in this. I mean, it's just phenomenal. Let's see, he's got his axe, cowboy hat on. And a samurai sword. Um, those are hands and feet flying everywhere. <laughs> that is awesome. Very graphic. Very adult. Uh, themes. 
the other really, really cool thing in here is when he, uh, each personality is talking, the bubble has uh, an outline of a sword uh, that's part of the bubble when the ninja talks, an axe when the viking talks, and then a pistol when the cowboy talks. This is number four. Beautiful cover. Looks like Zorro. I haven't met him yet in the, in the story. So, so that reminds me of that character. And then there's our main character. Gorgeous colors. I wish I had a better camera to pick these just amazing colors up. Look at that one. That's awesome. There's his personalities and then obviously him in the middle. Just... This Riley Rossmo is just unbelievable. Number five. This one is just so brilliant. Look at this, guys. That is awesome. There's the Viking, the Ninja Cowboy. There's Duncan right in front. Number six. look at them for a second they're awesome I love it oh man look at that guys I don't know if I noticed that but that's a big boo boo anyways it's not the number one that's in probably one of the best shape of all these they're all just phenomenal shape what is that one number six oh, this one is awesome look at the colors in that guys number seven the skull up here. Missiles coming in. That's cool. I like how they do the three heads, little logo down there. He's a badass assassin trained by the government. I think the tagline says something about, you know, Creating something with, uh, that is useless to society. That, that's what we deem uh, useless people with multiple personality disorder. They've made them uh, useful to their means. And have created uh, killing machines. Very adult, very awesome story. That's number seven. This is number eight. And look, you got him in the middle. Looks like, you know, he's fracturing, you know, he's, because his mind is obviously already fractured. And look at the colors, they're just amazing. Look at the greens and the, everything is not your normal, your normal color. Very visceral and in your face. Number eight, ooh, look at that one. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I haven't looked at these in a little bit. Look at those colors, man. Just absolute works of art. I would love to get my number one signed. And it looks like, you know, there's a good amount of space that I could probably get a really cool sketch on there, too. Awesome. This is number nine. Yeah, that's definitely a gorgeous cover. And then number ten, guys. Yeah, just amazing. There's not one normal red or purple or orange. Everything is so unique and the style is just... Look at that. That's awesome. Alright, so that'll be the end of this video. Time to go uh, watch some football. Hope everybody has a great Sunday and a great week coming up. I will uh, try to continue to get these videos of uh, the number one variants. And while I go through them, I will.
awesome everybody who has uh, subscribed thank you guys so much um, yeah this is just a great community any any new people that have uh, you know just recently started collecting this is an amazing thing um, I'm so happy to have a you know something that I can have some passion for it's awesome um, very new probably eight or nine months and I uh, have found some really amazing things, and uh, most of them are because of the people on uh, people in this community. So uh, again, thanks, guys. Go Texans! Have a great day. Peace, love, and comics. God bless.